The manufacturing of components for molds and stamping dies requires the machining of multiple parts to exacting tolerances and quality surface finishes. These are then assembled to create a tool which is used to produce a part to be used by itself or in the final product. Fusion 360 gives toolmakers an intuitive, easy to use CAM programming system with an extensive library of toolpath strategies to machine the components they need. 2D toolpaths such as pocketing and contouring along with drilling allow for the machining of features and holes typically found in the designs of ejection, stripper, and base plates. Adaptive clearing removes large volumes of material at fast rates while decreasing tool wear. Components such as die forms, mold cavities, and cores can be machined to a high quality surface finish with 3D toolpaths which look at the three-dimensional part geometry, steep and shallow, blend, parallel, geodesic, flow, and spiral, just to name a few, give you many options allowing you to create the toolpath needed to machine your part geometry. Specialized toolpaths like rotary pocket and contour simplify the process of machining cylindrical components and features, which can typically be found on parts like mold cores. Deep cavities, tall cores, and even a surface finish can benefit from the use of five axis machining, allowing the tool to move its axis in those hard to reach areas and tip to an optimum cutting angle. Three axis toolpaths can quickly be converted to five axis by applying a tool axis definition. Dedicated multi-axis strategies, such as SWARF, gives even further options. Material left in corners by the use of a larger tool during finishing is automatically identified and machined with the corner toolpath, ensuring your part detail is finished. Machine and part safety is always a concern as the machining of these components can take hours or even days. Collision avoidance automatically moves the tool axis to a safe machining position. Fusion 360 gives toolmakers the professional CAM programming tools they need to manufacture molds and dies, allowing them to make anything.